first topic is ideal fluids mm, these ideal fluids are incompressible non viscous non viscous and bulk modulus is infinity and bulk modulus is infinity and real fluids are they are compressible compressible they have viscosity so they are viscous and bulk modulus and bulk modulus is not infinity non infinity ideal fluids uh, don't have any surface tension so no surface tension uh, ideal fluids are basically imaginary and they don't exist in nature uh, there are a few values to remember the specific gravity specific gravity of water at 4 degrees Celsius is unity and for mercury and for mercury it is 13.6 specific gravity uh, this is a temperature dependent term so this should be determined at specific temperatures as 4 degrees Celsius or 27 degrees Celsius our next topic is Newton's law of viscosity Newton's law of viscosity so so Newton's law of viscosity says tau equals to mu du dy also equals to mu d theta dt so in this triangle this is du dt this is dy and this angle is d theta where tau is basically the shear stress and mu is coefficient of viscosity coefficient of viscosity and du dy is the velocity gradient velocity gradient and d theta dt is the rate of rate of angular deformation or it's the rate of shear strain or rate of shear strain so this is the formula for Newton's law of viscosity so basically due to viscosity a fluid offers a resistance to flow so now a point to remember about viscosity is this kinematic viscosity and that's new equals to dynamic viscosity dynamic viscosity that's symbol is mu divided by 
mass density mass density that's rho now the unit of kinematic viscosity is meter square per second uh, so the unit of dynamic viscosity uh, will be newton second per meter square or kg per meter second now few points to remember number one viscosity of a liquid decreases with temperature so basically viscosity down temperature goes up for liquid this is for liquid but for gas is just the opposite viscosity increases with increasing temperature gas. This happens in gases because the Brownian motion uh, increases in case of gas with increasing temperature. This creates more randomness, more number of collision, so the viscosity increases. Now the origin of viscosity, so viscosity is due to cohesive force or intermolecular intermolecular forces of cohesion this is dominant in liquid this is for liquid whereas for gas uh, this is the transfer of molecular momentum between the fluid layers molecular momentum between fluid layers